Hi guys. Uh, so this is our uh, reflection reflection video one from uh, my my Shafika mm, and my uh, presentation just now. Uh, so uh, my name is Alia. My metric number my metric number is one nine nine seven six seven. Shafika. My name is Nur Shafika bin Yahya. My metric number is one nine nine seven six three. My name is uh, Adila. Uh, my metric number is 199025. My name is Afika Binti Akasha. My metric number is 202989. Hi, my name is Siti Nurami Rabiti Tumadi and my metric number is 202265. Hi, my name is Rafiza. My metric number is 199828. So, um, uh, I, uh, um, I just uh, present, I and Shafika just present just now. So what you guys think about uh, Baju Kurung uh, to attend a uh, wedding event? What your, what you guys, uh, what your opinion about that? In my um, opinion, uh, because uh, these days, uh, especially in women, the fashion is getting more and more extreme it doesn't matter if like uh if you go to uh, a ceremony you don't really have to like uh must wear a baju kurung because baju kurung uh there are so many types of baju kurung if you are talking about the formal one it should be like the baju kurung pahang the one that uh, like quite loose and the cut is very uh it looks very quite light but these days we have so many fashion that have been modified uh, from baju kurung into a lot of uh, other outfits as well. So I think as long as they are wearing something that won't overshadow both brides and groom, that should be fine. But of course, you don't you don't go to wedding look by uh, wearing slippers. So of course, the proper attire should be considered as well. Yeah, uh, I agree with your opinion, Afika, because um, me, myself, I went to a wedding wearing a blouse, but I will wear a skirt, which is uh, with sh uh, covered shoes, because I think it's uh, proper because I will not overshadow the couple, obviously, because I'm wearing a very minimal accessories, um, uh, very polite and very, how to say, um, it's pretty but not pretty enough to overshadow any couple uh, that uh, for the wedding. How about you, Amira? Yes, I also agree with Afika and Adila because sometimes I think, mm, <coughs> okay, actually, I don't like to wear a baju kurung. So I prefer to choose a blouse and skirt to go to the wedding event. So that's why I agree with Adila and Afika. Yeah. Uh, and as you mentioned uh, in the presentation just now about the perfume, right? Uh, I think uh, the people who is go to the wedding event uh, uh, must avoid use a strong perfume as many people can be allergic to them. So I think if we want to wear a perfume, just wear a perfume that a a simple. Ah, yes. Yeah. Yes, that's correct. Right. Yeah. So, uh, Kak Fiza, you have your opinion about the presentation? <coughs> okay, for my opinion, um, actually, um, I prefer <coughs> to wear some kind of like baju kurung, baju kurung pahang, and so on. But sometimes, um, uh, depends on uh, depends on the day. If um, I feel like uh, it's too hot, I prefer to wear a simple blouse and uh, uh, a very simple skirt. But um, still uh, proper to attend the wedding ceremony and looks looks polite and uh, the important 
the most important is we are not overshadow the brides uh, because uh, as as we know uh, nowadays um, uh, so many uh, people uh, like to what uh, to over over make up you know so uh, sometimes I saw that um, they overshadow the bride so uh, uh, I don't know which bride is <laughs> is for the uh, the wedding so i think uh, we have to wear a proper uh, attire and not um uh, not um overshadow the bride so uh kak fiza uh, you have children children so uh do what what kind of attire that you think uh proper for a mother and for uh what you call uh for mother when you attend uh wedding ceremony because you need to handle your kids instead of like us we we are uh just for our own self but you need to keep your 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 yeah, kids yeah. around you um as a mother and i have about uh, five children uh it's actually very hard to handle them uh especially when we attend um uh, that um some kind of uh occasion so what i will uh wear is uh, i will wear a simple blouse and um skirt and uh, the important thing is my shoes. I will wear a flat shoes because I can uh, move around. Uh, Walk easily. Easily, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> because I have to handle my kids. Uh, they run everywhere here and there. So I think uh, I have to wear some, some um, I, I have to wear uh, especially shoes, flat shoes. Lah. I cannot, uh, I cannot wear heels like other people. Yeah, yeah. Uh, and uh, for me, um, uh, one more thing for uh, breastfeeding mother, uh, I think uh, we have uh, uh, nowadays we have uh, breastfeeding shirts. You know that uh, yeah, when uh, our baby wants to feed, we can easily feed them, uh, and mm, nobody can see us. Uh, you know what I mean? Yeah. yeah. So yeah. Uh, I want to know your your guys' uh, opinion about what a proper accessory when attend a wedding event. What you guys think about the accessory? Mm, the very minimal accessory such as um, yes, uh, brooch, I think. A brooch, brooch, yeah. Bracelet, maybe like ah yeah. Bracelet, I think. Huh, <laughs> just a simple and minimal. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Welcome yeah. to wedding. Wear something like Datuk Sri Wida. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. 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 But, 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 but and the uh, very fabulous. But outfit. how about <laughs> if if the? If I were the bride, I would kick her out of the wedding. <laughs> but sorry. <laughs> What if the the event uh, the sorry, the the wedding event is like VIP wedding event in the hotel in the exclusive uh hall? I think, I think same because we as the um guest what we call the guest we have to wear very minimal accessories. Mm. Yeah. So I think that's. A very proper way. So yeah, I think the same as Kak Fiza, Fiza because I think we should not overshadow the the bride. Okay, so if you want to wear not um something more um more fashion or more beautiful, we more must extra. not overshadow yeah. the. I wish I did the bride because they will wear the same outfit like the gown, right? So we don't. I think we cannot or we should not wear gown that are similar or more fabulous than the bride. 
Shafika, do you have any to add about this? Me? Yeah. Uh, I also agree with uh, Afika said just now uh, because uh, nowadays uh, um, not many people are wearing only baju kurung. They are wearing gloves with skirt. I also saw many of people. So not only the choice of baju kurung we should wear uh, to wedding uh, event. So the conclusion is uh, uh, just like uh, Shabka said, we we have so many choices in, uh, instead of uh, baju kurung, and um, also about the uh, perfume and the accessory and a proper uh, 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 the attire for the mother. So I think that's all for this reflection video one so thank you for participate in this uh reflection video thank you all right thank you thank you, thank you. Bye -bye. Bye -bye. the next video bye, bye, -bye.